BCIT's AME-E program was developed using Transport Canada regulatory requirements. What makes this program so unique is the variety of aircraft in our hair. Our most modern airplane in our fleet is the Bombardier CRJ-100. It's a modern airplane with electronic flight instrument systems, multiple computer systems and networks. Students will get a chance to operate many of these systems. BCAT has an excellent reputation for providing a well-structured training program. We're quite confident that the students are getting what they need for tools to keep up with the industry as it's changing. I recommend BCIT to individuals who are interested in becoming an aircraft maintenance engineer because the training aids and the methods of teaching work excellent for students who are interested in learning the basics and helping students identify fasteners, helping students identify tools, how to use them correctly, how to use them safely. An aircraft maintenance engineer with an E-category certifies work accomplished on an aircraft's electrical and electronic systems. These systems include communication, navigation, autopilot, as well as the electronic components of other systems, such as engine and flight controls, environmental controls, fire protection, just to name a few. The AME-E program is 68 weeks of instruction, and they will earn their diploma in 18 months. They'll learn all the theoretical concepts and develop hand skills in the program. The instruction at BCIT is quite excellent. Most of the instructors come from technical backgrounds in the industry, so they're very familiar with the changes and adapt the courses accordingly. I like that the instructors were all different and they all had their own approaches to teaching. One person would say, for example, use PowerPoints, and another person would primarily speak or use the aircraft in the hangar. So to become an aircraft maintenance engineer category E, or AME-E, a student has to complete training, work in industry, complete specific tasks, then write a test. BCIT graduates will receive 18 months accreditation for their 48 months work experience. Therefore, they only have to work 30 months in industry before they can challenge the test and become an AME. My social life has changed. Before I was more an introvert, not really talking to a lot of people yet. Now here I am walking around through the hangar going, hey, hi, to somebody across the other room. It's changed like that because that's part of the job. It's part of being able to communicate, and communication is a massive part of not only working here at Jazz, it's also part of the industry as well. We've been quite satisfied with the graduates that we've hired on from DCIT. They come in the door with all the basic training needs that we're looking for. It's a very fast-paced industry. It's ever-changing. There's a lot of challenges for the employees when they start but we feel that they're very prepared when they come out of PCIT and well geared for a career in aviation.